Seriously, I look huge. Brooke, girl. Why I look so big? You look very small, like this small. What? I look small. <laughs> oh, you trying to win brownie points. <laughs> okay, it worked. Now I can see the spots. I can't even see the camera anymore, Brooke. No. Okay, are we in the camera lens? I can't even see us. Yeah. I'm seeing spots from the lights. Yeah, me too. It's this, if you turn off the light, it will look good. <laughs> is it recording? Yes. Right now? Yes. Is the thing on zero or is the numbers moving? Every time I look at it, I see white lights over it. Numbers moving. <gasps> it's recording. Hey, y'all. It's me and Brooke. Girl, get up in the shot. Come on, honey. Yes. Get up in the shot. So it's me and, I'm gonna scoot this closer, okay? If I swear, I want you to slap me on the knee real hard, but only if I say a bad word, okay? Don't be slapping me just because you think it's funny. I'm, I'm on to you. Uh, so I asked people uh, if they would give us some questions that we could answer. You know, because Brooke's a very smart young lady. How old are you now, 20? No. How old are you? Yes. Seven. No, less. Six. And a half. It's the big one, Elizabeth. Six and a half. When did that happen, honey? You are so old. Let me. I'm gonna check you for gray hairs. What? We're not gonna play games. We came here. Look. First of all, I want to show you all. Brooke is an accomplished scholar. Uh, she's also artistic, smart, caring, kind, uh, and fabulous. Honey, can you kind of uh, sit up a little bit higher so they can see that you are wearing a red sequins dress, y'all? Uh, fabulous cream, kind of a cream fur vest, kind of like a bolero vest, right? A fabulous polka dotted bow with many Mouse fabulous shoes, y'all. She is a princess and a half. So y'all, she brought her folder and I want to brag. So is there, do you have a name for this folder? Know Your Dog. Oh, this is the Know Your Dog folder? No. Then what is it? It's your dog folder. Your dog, this is your dog folder. No. But I'm saying, what do you put in here? What do you put in this folder? Cool. School stuff, and this is all the good stuff that you do in school, right? The stuff you're proud of? Honey, I had one of those notebooks, and it was all pictures of mermaids. The only thing I was proud of was my drawings of mermaids. Isn't that weird? Is that weird? Be honest. Is that strange? Maybe don't be so honest next time. Uh, when I first uh, asked her what she was most proud of, y'all, she, is this the page right here? Is it this whole, both of these? Yeah. Five and six? Hold on, I think there's three. <gasps> Did I just look like a teacher when I lick my finger? <laughs> it's because when you get old, you get you all dry. Like, you look like a girl teacher. A girl teacher? Mm -hmm. Honey, how many girl teachers do you have that are bald with a beard? I, I think that says a lot about your teachers. Uh, she said that her teachers look like me. Her girl teachers. Are you saying that I have pretty eyes? Is that what you're saying? No. <laughs> And that was a compliment, princess. So this is what we have that she is proud of. First of all, look at this. And I want you to know how much I love this because the first thing it says is be yourself. And when you come to my house on our front door, did you notice the sign on our front door? So I have to show you. On our door knocker, I have a sign hanging from it that says be yourself. So I love that the first thing you showed me today was this activity you're proud of. It says be yourself and feel good about saying no, y'all. Say no to drugs. Say no to cholesterol. Say no to saturated fat. Say no to cupcakes. Are you saying say no to cupcakes? No. Uh, what about uh, frosting on cupcakes? Can we still have that? Yes. Thank and whipped cream. Thank God! They're not brainwashing you in these schools. <coughs> Woo! Oh, by the way, what do you want the background to be right now? iPad. Poof! Okay, y'all, it's an iPad. I told her that whenever she wanted, she just had to tell me where she wanted to be, and that's where we would go. So whenever you want to change it from an iPad, you think of something, you just tell me, all right? And she also brought this bucket, y'all, and I'm a little jealous, because I have a feeling it this... It might glow. I start to say, I think this glows in the dark. Y'all, like... look. <laughs> it's a picture of my mom, her Grammy. Oh my gosh! They had, this is an x-ray of my mom. The last time she went to the doctor, they got a screen capture and we put it on this glow bucket. Oh, that's not, that's now, not what happened. my mom got it from a dollar store. Girl, how you gonna wrap me out like that? Don't fall off the chair, honey. Don't fall off the chair. Your knee was popping. Why was your knee, you, you got weak knees? I don't know. 
All right, my niece got weak Only knees. Only one. Yeah, you got a weak knee. It's that one, right? That one popped. Because I was holding your leg and I could feel it pop when you moved. What, did you fall? No. Oh, you just got a weak, you know your Aunt Teresa yeah, got Yeah, one, it feels like it's broken a little. Yeah? yeah? Well, you know that your Aunt Teresa has some weak ass ankles, honey. What's that game? Don't, don't be worried about mm. games. We're mm. going to look at questions. Mm. Okay, you ready? Okay, y'all, we're about to answer these questions. Do you want to, you want the background to change before we get started on the yes. questions? Well, what do you want it to be? Beach. Beach. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Do you smell the ocean air, Brooke? No. <laughs> then why are we staying here? Let's go somewhere else. Take us somewhere else other than the beach. Mm, bubbles place. Bubbles! Wait, whipped cream! Whipped cream! <laughs> us eating it. Us eating whipped cream. How about we just stick with bubbles? and answer these questions, okay? Look, we have 32 questions. All right, let's answer some of these questions, okay? I'm gonna start with the very first one because I thought it was cute. Okay, you ready? First question, if you had to choose between a mermaid and a unicorn, what would it be? Which is your favorite, a mermaid? A unicorn. A unicorn? Why? Because it has a horn and it has sparkles on it. Really? Does that have anything to do with the fact that your uncle Justin may or may not be a unicorn? Yes. It looks like you have a, a thing right there, like a unicorn. Thing. Seriously, I am a unicorn. And you know what else? No, you're not. That I am a unicorn. What do you think this is? This is a magical horn, honey. It's not a no, pimple. It's not. It you is a pimple. Squeeze it and see if anything comes out. Yeah. Go on, squeeze it. Nope. That's a unicorn horn. Listen, I want to tell you a story. Listen, I used to be a dog in a former life. Mm -mm. No, I'm going to prove it. You want me to prove it? So in a former life, I used to be a dog, and I was in a dog fight. And I got bit in the back of the neck. And to this day, I still have a lump in the back of my neck from when I was in the... Feel it. Feel it. <laughs> I made that story up. I didn't used to be a dog. I know. Ah Next question. What do you think about your Uncle Justin's hair? Bald. Fair <laughs> enough. Next question. I'm not answering. We're not doing that because we don't have any pins. They want you to draw on my head. I'll draw on your head. I don't have anything to draw with. Then go upstairs and get it. You go upstairs and get it. I don't know what to do. I'm not putting something permanent on my head, girl. Well. Listen, I, uh, I'm a professional. I can't go out like that. Get, look, do you do if you can, uh, do you like SpongeBob SquarePants? Yes. Okay, who do you like best, SpongeBob SquarePants or Patrick? SpongeBob. SpongeBob. All right, the queen has spoken. Okay, do you think every little girl has a crazy uncle just like you do? Uh, no. Why not? Because. He doesn't wear sparkles. Listen, I want to know who this crazy uncle is. Can I meet him? Yes. Who is he? You. <laughs> I've never met him before. <laughs> I might not like him. If you could make up one rule that everybody in the world had to listen to, one thing, if everybody in the world had to do this one thing, what so would like, it be? You know, people could stop fighting, or people could, you know, be nice to each other, or uh, be uh, have better hair. I don't know. Whatever you want have to tell. Have better hair. No, don't be shallow. What would you really want to tell people? Have um, the one thing you could have everybody do in the whole world? Mm. Hug Uncle Justin. Oh, <laughs> do we get do I, do I give good hugs? <laughs> I smell good though, right? I do smell good. You You're smell like old Uncle Justin. <laughs> Did you say old Uncle Justin? Yes. I'm gonna need a moment. Okay, next question. Uh, have you ever seen, uh, do you know who Donald Trump is? Hold on, I'm gonna pull up a picture. All right, you stay right here. I want you to describe, I'm gonna pull up a picture of somebody's hair, and I want you to describe his hair, okay? His name is Donald Trump, and he might be our next president, okay? I'm gonna pull up a picture, you ready? This is Donald Trump, I want you to describe his hair, what you think of his hair, okay? Not his ratchet face, his hair, okay? <laughs> he looks like he has blonde like yours. <laughs> but what does it look like? It looks like he's like blushed out. <laughs> he got a, honey, I think he got a fresh blowout. 
It does look like freshly blow dried, doesn't it? Yeah. Do you think it's all his hair, or do you think he's got it like combed over? I don't know. I don't know. We don't know. Okay. Next question. You can read faster than I can. Why is Uncle Justin an awesome uncle? Oh, I like that question. Thank you, Pamela. Why is Justin, uh, your Uncle Justin, such an awesome uncle? Because baby Cece grown. Because baby Cece's grown? Yeah. What does that mean? Like, because she's growing up good and I'm, it's because I'm taking care of her. I like to think that's what you're saying. Okay, high five on that. Yeah. Whoop, whoop. Okay. What is the nicest thing anyone has ever done for you? Ooh, that's a good question. Mm, let me sleep in my mom's bedroom. Mm. And on the couch. You like sleeping in your mom's bed? There's something about sleeping in your mom. Well, not when you're my age. It's kind of weird Wait. when you're my age. I and what is the nicest thing you've ever done for somebody? Like, ever, the nicest thing you've ever done to or for someone? Mm -hmm. That you can think of. Love my mom and love you. Hmm? Love my mom, love Grammy and Papa, love you, Aww, love baby Cece. That's really sweet. Give me a hug. I love you. Mwah. I love you, girl. I love them little wild beast hugs. Okay, so let's go to the next question. You got a lot of questions, honey. Okay, so, oh, I lost the thing. You probably know how to use this better than me. Snow in here. Make it snow in here. Snow! All right, it's snowing, girl. Put your coat on. All right, what does it mean to be a person who does kind things? That's a good question. You. What does it mean, like, when it, when you hear that somebody is kind, what does it make you think like of? Like taking care of baby CCs. Like taking care of people? Yeah. Someone who takes care of someone. That is kind. That's always kind to take care of somebody else. And... What does it mean to be a person who does unkind things? Not nice things. It means like when you're being bad and hitting people and like punch them in the face. Mm -hmm. That's true. And you have saying pretty, a lie. You have very pretty eyes, by the way, and that's the truth. Okay. Oh, Teresa, this is a mean question. Teresa's mean. This is from Teresa Rizaliti. It's no, not, not really mean. Here, can you get up taller? Come up taller. Uh -huh. Listen, Teresa's not mean. Uh, she wants to know how old you think I am, for real. Be very careful how you answer that. Why? Because I may or may not push you off this chair, depending on your answer. 22. How old do you think I am? Okay. <laughs> well, Teresa recently she went to now. How old do you think I am? 65. <laughs> oh, is the chair getting loose? Oh, goodness, I think the chair came loose. She's right. I'm 65 years old. Okay, next question. Can you add your butt? Like, like, hurt people. Yeah, somebody hurts really? other people's feelings, like a bully, maybe? Yeah. I have or a like, bully in my fish tank. You have a bully in your fish tank. Yeah. What's he doing? Is all he, of them. Is he calling them all names? Calling everybody names in your fish tank? No! What's he say? You fat fish? What's he say? No, he's... Uh, uh, yeah. I have a question. Okay. Cha uh, change it into a small and seaweed. You want to be under the water with seaweed? Yeah. Ocean! Bing! With mermaids. You see the mermaids, girl? You better swim. Okay, as we float, oh, you just spit right all over my face, girl. Oh, it's like, you know, when you come up out of the water, you go, <laughs> uh, 3D effects here, y'all. It's like the IMAX. Oh my God, high five. I can't believe how old you're and getting. And this tooth is wiggled. Did it hurt when it came out? What? Your tooth. I pulled out this one at school. You pulled it out yourself? Yes. How, with your finger? Yes. How, you just went, <laughs> Yeah, I did three clicks when I was using the toilet. Yeah. And then after, I just jumped it out. Uh. <laughs> I think I passed out a little bit. I smell eggs. Why I smell eggs, Brooke? I smell eggs! Oh. 
She can read. Dang, she reads so much faster than me. What would you consider the perfect day with your Uncle Justin? Uh, baby Cece and the dog. You want to play with baby Cece and the dog all day? And the cat. You want me to go let Bojangles out? You don't mind him jumping up on you? Yeah, I don't mind. Okay, we'll go let him out after this. And then you, a Biscuit's in there with him, too. You know, they're like best friends now. Who's Biscuit? The, the cat. cat. The cat that always hides from you that you barely ever see. Yeah. The little fat one uh, is in Ooh. heaven. Why do you call him fat? Because he was fat. He died of an obesity problem. What's obesity? He was huge. Huge? Huge. What's that mean? Why? Wait, can we, can we climb up on the house? You know I'm scared of heights. What kind of question is that, girl? You know uh, I get shaky need when I get up high. Uh, can we can we go upstairs? Like 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 walking upstairs. We don't have stairs, honey. We live in a ranch. Oh, you want us to look like we have steps behind us? Yeah. Well, that was a whole lot of um, explaining just to say steps. Very good, yeah. girl. Your snap worked. Look at those steps all around us, y'all. My my my. Oh, there's spiders everywhere. Spiders. I don't like Seven spiders! Oh, so, oh, I got one. Haunted house! Ooh. <laughs> Happy Halloween, y'all! We love you! Bye! <laughs>